show being Erica Erin Carplux's ability to travel through time and right the wrongs in her past has added the bonus of never being stuck in the waiting room at the doctor's office. Take a look. Who's Dr. Nadia? Um, that's nobody. It's just, uh, it's just work. What are you going to have? Oh, I was thinking of the risotto. Miss, are you Erica Strange? Yes. I have a Dr. Nadia on the phone for you. What? She's calling you here? Um, excuse me. I'm just going to take care of this. Okay. Sorry. Hello. Sorry about the interruption, but we need to talk. There is nothing to talk about. I told you I quit. It. Wish it were that easy. Please welcome Aaron Carpluck. <laughs> So this is the second season premiere tonight, right? Where you actually go, you're able to go back in time and mm -hmm. right all the wrongs. So how does yeah. your character do that? Is it all teleportation? What's, give us the rundown. Oh, the actual scientific explanation yes. part, I'm not 100% sure, to yes. be honest. We do in season two, we go more into the time travel. Mm -hmm. um, Erica meets Dr. Tom, yeah. who is a mysterious therapist, and he sends her back in time. Wow. So it's the doctor that does it. Wish we could all go back. Yeah, that's what I, I want to ask you. Is there anything that you would ever want to go back and change if you could? Where to begin? Where to begin? <laughs> um, there was one time I was vacationing in Maui, and I had to do some voice work for being Erica. And production was kind enough to fly me to Honolulu to do it. So I was very excited. So I put my favorite sundress on, my big shades, and I bought this knockoff bag from the farmer's market. Yes. <laughs> and as I landed and I was walking out to catch a taxi cab, I didn't realize, but the bag was actually kind of scooching my skirt up to the point where I was mooning the entire <laughs> airport. And I don't, I don't get embarrassed that easily, but there was two gentlemen that were standing behind me. And finally, one of them, like, after five minutes, is like, ma'am, you're... Your skirt is tucked up. And I remember going back, and all I felt was my backside. <laughs> and then his friend turned to me, and he's like, I wasn't going to say anything. And, and so anyways, mortified. And you I just worse when you were in the wrong underwear. Yeah, it was not full you, uh, you were underwear. You were wearing underwear. I was wearing uh, okay. underwear, yes. Okay. Okay. yes. That's okay. Oh, yeah. No, that's OK. <laughs> Still crying more time. I, I've tucked my skirts into my pantyhose many times. <laughs> You know, when you, yeah, if you come out of the ladies' room and you, you realize you've tucked your skirt into the panic, it's really, of you've course. never done that. What am I, the only one? <laughs> oh, I guess it's just me. Well, that stinks to be you. No, just kidding. Uh, tonight I heard you do something that you're, that's not typical, right, on the show? Mm -hmm. What is that? For some reason, in season two, they have me doing a lot of singing and dancing. So oh, for yeah. that, I apologize in advance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that good. Um, in the premiere, we go back to a point where Erica is doing some coyote, ugly style, sexy dancing. Oh. And, yeah, and so I remember the choreographer, she's like, and sexy, and sexy. And all the girls that were dancing were great, and I almost fell off the bar doing it. So, <laughs> but I tried. Did you I always tried. want to be an actress when you were a little girl in Canada, in Vancouver? Um. I grew up in a very small town in Jasper National oh. Park in Alberta, mm. and oh, it's I, not Vancouver. No, I live no. in Vancouver now. Now, yeah. oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, I love it. So it's beautiful. Were well, you an actress when you were little? Did you want to do this? We didn't have drama in Jasper. I, I played mm. hockey and and went skiing, and I actually accidentally got accepted into uh, the University of Victoria as a theater major oh. in fine arts. And my mom's like, "You are not going to be an actor." And and so I called the department. and I said. Well, we only accept one in five, so if you're at all interested, go for yeah, it. Thank and, you. Yeah, wow. and so there I was four years later, and, and it was a very happy accident. Well, yeah. I mean, this is so great because your show is seen in over 30 countries. Mm -hmm. You got this huge billboard in Times Square. So how are you handling it, girl? I haven't seen it yet. My That's friend great. took a picture, and she... Oh, is that it? Yep. There it is. Yeah, oh, my goodness. See, you have to oh, see it in person. It's huge on Broadway. Wow. You're it's... I mean, it's been really exciting, and, and when you go on shows, you never know how they're going to be received. Mm -hmm. So this is just, I'm just really excited in Florida and, and so happy that people are enjoying it. Yeah, and so, now, yeah. You, oh. you mentioned, oh, go ahead, whoops. Oh. I was just going to say, you know, <laughs> earlier we, we were talking about how you view yourself as, mm -hmm. a, as a person. You are shooting, I assume, in, in Canada. Mm -hmm. So you don't have the same pressures that a lot of folks get when they're in Hollywood and stuff to look a certain way or be a certain way. But you don't feel like that would that would make you go in one direction or the other. How You're do you? You're moving there, right? Aren't you moving to Hollywood too? I am. I just so... I just received my green card. Right. Oh, um, 
Uh, thank you. Thank so you. Gonna, yeah. well, but what about the pressures we'll be talking about in terms of like all the surgery we're hearing about? Oh, no. Your no. ears look fine. You don't thank you. Thank you. Please live more. Um, you know, I've, I, I, hopefully nothing changes. I think that, um, you know, I'm 31 and I kind of know who I am and, uh, and, you know, you surround yourself with really good people. Yeah. And you mean you don't good. want the triple D boobs? No, no, no you're fine <laughs> the way you are. You're we have fine. to say, Erin, we want to good. wish you luck tonight on the second season Thank premiere. You. Thanks for coming by. Good luck with the move. Being Erica airs Wednesday nights at 10 p.m. on SofaNet, and we'll be right Great. back. Thanks.